I have to say I'm very honored and proud to be now for the third time to be invited uh, to this very, very famous and uh, high class uh, course, to be honest. And I said it even in the group to the, to the students that I'm so impressed about their understanding what, what I was telling them the whole day it was very demanding we were mm -hmm. sometimes in, in some matters very deeply uh, discussing things and uh, you realize then that they are totally focused and they prove that they understood the whole thing with their questions and um, I, I told them I shouldn't say it loudly but uh, I'm, improved, I'm impressed by the questions they raised I would wish those questions at that level would be in our discussions with, with others who are working in the football industry. So, um, yeah, I, I'm really happy and uh, you can be proud of this group because uh, they hopefully should get involved in, in, in professional football. This would be the new generation. They would uh, contribute a lot in a positive sense to the, the mm -hmm. game. Well, thank you for that. Of course, uh, we hope to see you again next year. And also, one of our, our former students, Varun, is now working at the European League as a data and CRM expert. Uh, could you tell us a little more about uh, Varun's job and um, his expertise and how he contributes to the mission and the goals of your organization? Uh, he's working on, let's say, on a consultancy basis, but uh, he was one of the students two years ago I met and uh, suddenly we were in, still in contact and now we, we decided a while ago to create this so-called cloud-based data warehouse mm -hmm. where we uh, upload and collect a lot of data and uh, we are in contact with Warhol nearly on a daily basis via Skype calls uh, with my colleagues, uh, project manager, uh, project leader and Warhol is contributing in a unique way uh, uploading and gathering all this data and creating the project itself. So, just to give you a, a practical example, uh, what we took, what took us uh, a while ago, weeks to research and to get the, the, the facts and data we have now, within minutes, mm -hmm. as after we have uploaded the data, now Varun is in a position to provide us, for example, with all the the money which has been paid since 1992 when uh, UEFA Champions League was, was uh, installed until now we can per click tell you the exact amount every club Real Madrid, Bayern Munich have, have earned and for example that there were altogether more than 15 billion of the money paid out and we have a percentage which club earned uh, which money and so on so it's amazing it's an amazing tool this helps us uh, to, to have fact-based discussions with the other stakeholders and uh, we consider it just as a starting point. So it will be, it will be a, an interesting way to go and I'm very grateful that Varun is doing such a great job. Mm -hmm. and recently, uh, we know Varun received a big applause from all uh, major leagues at the General Assembly of the <coughs> European Leagues in Frankfurt. Uh, why was that? And uh, could you share this anecdote with us? Of course, with pleasure. So we had our General Assembly last Friday in Frankfurt and uh, I, I gave an introduction to this uh, really, in my opinion, extraordinary project. So the project leader, my colleague Chris, explained it then and before I gave him the floor, I, I explained a little bit the role of Varun and then I said, you know, uh, ladies and gentlemen, and there were about 70, 80 representatives of our 35 member leagues, including uh, ECA and UEFA, and I told them that in, in a very easy way, you know, and uh, you cannot miss Varun, he's sitting over there in the last row with his uh, beard. Mm -hmm. And uh, Varun, kind of stand up that people can see you. And then I was, I was really impressed. Varun stand up with a smile and suddenly somebody started to, to applaud him. And uh, the whole audience gave him such a big applause. And then the smile of Varun was even a bigger one than normal. <laughs> And he was so proud and when, when uh, we said goodbye then I said, so Varun, thank you for coming, how was your day? And he said, you know Gail, one of the best days in my life because of this nice uh, and warm welcome at the GA. So I was so happy for him and uh, he's more motivated than ever to succeed with this uh, project. And that's lovely to hear.